me, um, my husband, say hi. Okay, say hi. Are you just gonna smile? Oh my gosh. Anyways, um, we are driving to Prim, Nevada to go shopping at the outlets. We are in Las Vegas right now. I don't know if you can see all of the, uh, stuff out there. Buildings. Anyhow, um, tomorrow we get to meet everybody for the weight loss surgery meet and greet. Um, we're actually here for our anniversary, so that's why we didn't go for the three days. Um, tomorrow is the day we go meet with everybody, and then the day after that is our one-year wedding anniversary. Yay! Um, but we are staying at the Trump Towers, and it's nice. It's not bad. Um, the jacuzzi tub is freaking awesome. It's huge. It's ginormous. That was a hubby. He actually talked. Wow. Um, yeah, it's really big. Last night we went and saw the Tournament of Kings at the Excalibur, which we're driving past right now. Um, and that was a lot of fun. Uh, like knights, you know, fighting and stuff, which was kind of funny because we had to eat with our hands because, you know, medieval times you don't have, like, utensils or anything like that. You had to eat with your hands. But I'm really picky about the way that I eat like the stuff that I eat and I'll eat chicken but I'm not the kind of person that can eat chicken on the bone because the bone grosses me out well they brought out a chicken that looked like a rotisserie chicken where it was like a full chicken where you had to like break off the legs and all everything was still attached and there was like a hole for like you know the insides and it came out and I was like oh my gosh and my husband immediately was like you're not gonna eat it are you? I was like um probably not and so he had to actually take the chicken off my plate stick it on his and <laughs> he had to like pull the turkey or the chicken apart and give me the breast of the chicken because that's the only part that I'll eat and so that was kind of funny and then he mentioned you would never survive in medi medieval times which I probably wouldn't I would have been a shriveled up mess and I never would have needed gastric bypass then but um <laughs> yeah, um, I've been sick, so that's why I didn't really do a video before we left. Um, so you can kind of tell my voice is a little bit hoarse, but I'm getting over it. I just have like all that crap in my chest now. Eh, not fun. But I've been seeing a bunch of uh, posts on Facebook of everybody that's in Vegas that are um, like doing the meet and greet and it just looks like a lot of fun but I'm having a lot of fun because for the first time since my boob job I've been able to actually wear cute clothes and well not been able to wear cute clothes but I mean been able to like go out on the town and feel like good about myself and so it's a lot of fun and hope he's having fun say something say something <laughs> see I told him tomorrow when we go to the meet and greet don't be all quiet and shy. I was like, you need to start talking. Be yourself because this the one that I know is the one that's all sarcastic and funny. And then the one that everybody else knows is like super quiet and like doesn't talk to people unless, you know, he knows them really that well. That is not true. That is true. No, it's not. He disagrees. Mm -hmm. We'll see. We'll see what people have to say after they do their meet and greet videos. No, I don't know. But anyhow, my husband made a joke about this owl and said, isn't it kind of funny that the owl is by your hooters? I was like, you're an idiot. Hooters. <laughs> what? Hooters. <laughs> oh, stupid. <laughs> Anyways, we're having a good time. Um, we're actually here until Friday, so another week we still have. Yay! And then we're actually going to Santa Cruz. Um, Boardwalk. Um, after if that, you can find the ticket. hey, shh. We don't need to tell everybody that I lose everything. I do. I lose everything. Yeah, he seems to give me stuff, thinking that I'll be able to put it in a safe place, but I hide it so well that I can't even find it later, or I just misplace it. And anyhow, we bought tickets from Costco for the Boardwalk, and I don't know where it is. <laughs> it was like fifty-four bucks. 
So we're gonna have to be digging when we get home before we go to the beach. No, you are. <laughs> I am. You're gonna be digging. I'm gonna be digging. <laughs> Anyways, well, that's it for now, guys. I hope everybody's doing great. I don't know what I weigh because I don't have a scale, which is kind of odd because I'm not used to not having a scale um, to weigh myself on, but I don't think I've gained anything because my clothes all fit me loosely, so I've probably lost some weight. Um, plus, we're doing a lot of walking around here, so. Other than that, um, I will check back in after tomorrow or maybe during tomorrow. I don't know. All right, bye, everybody. Say bye, Mike. Say bye. Gosh darn it. Bye bye. <laughs>